Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Um, today's video is we're filming about how to polish a tarnished necklace. So this one is pretty. Is it focusing, Kako? Yeah, it's focusing. So this. I just do this to make it. Work. All right, I have two right here. So this is pretty tarnished, guys. Look at the difference. I'll show you the difference between the. I don't know if you can see it, but this necklace I have is pretty tarnished. And see the difference? Look. Between the two. Is it focusing right now, Kako? I'm not really sure. Pretty sure it is. Yeah, it is. So, this is the, the necklace that's not tarnished, and this one is the tarnished one. I don't know if you could tell the difference, but anyways. So guys, what we need is the dry cloth and toothpaste. That's all you need. Um, I use this one. Come on, focus. So we're going to use this toothpaste. This is my favorite toothpaste, by the way. So let's do it. So you're going to do is toothpaste, necklace, dry cloth. So basically, you just... I would prepare to take this off first. I'll take this off, separate them. Yep. And then let's try cleaning this one first. So literally just put the toothpaste in there and then rub it in. Just have to rub it. In. It's crazy though how it just works. My mother-in-law is the best. She saved my life. So sorry about my shirt. I'm not trying to be and sense it up here. Just look, I just rub it for like, literally, for just a few minutes. Ta-da! Look at the necklace. Oh my goodness, it's crazy. Look how it turned out. Oh my gosh, I don't know if you guys could see this, but I'm gonna focus it that's what it looks like now guys it's crazy it blows my mind simple as that I was just rubbing it the difference now guys oh my goodness so this is the pendant and that's the chain see that see the difference between the pendant and the chain crazy look at how pretty tarnish still so I'm gonna clean the chain now because I'm done with the pendant all right, let's do it. So same thing. And that's the cloth. Look how dirty the cloth is. That's the necklace already, guys. Oh my gosh, look. That's it. That's how you do it. Thank you so much, Mom, for teaching me how to do this. Oh my goodness. Look. You guys, it's pretty clean now. My gosh, now compare, compare to this one. Look, the difference. My God. Stephanie Nicholas. So this side, I just cleaned this one. I showed it to you guys. Look at how tarnished this one is. This is, will be the next one I'm gonna clean. Look at the difference. <gasps> Crazy, right? So yeah, it's clean this one now, guys. So same thing. Put it in here in the dry cloth and then paste all over it. Oh, this toothpaste is, smells amazing. I like how it's all natural and stuff. All right, rub it in. Start rubbing it in. Take this one out real quick, guys. Take that one out. And then we gotta rub this one good. This is kind of tricky though, because this is like this chain necklace is has loops and loops. So look how dirty that is. Yuck. I don't know if my camera is still focusing or my headshot. Pretty darn sad if I'm not. Filming it right. 
stalkers. <gasps> Look at guys. Look how dirty that is. Oh my gosh, you guys. You need to try this at home. If it pays, it's legit my favorite. So I'm gonna add more guys. So guys, you just keep rubbing, keep rubbing, keep rubbing until it's, you know, to your, until it's clean. That's all you gotta do, guys. Well, credit to my mother-in-law. It's pretty simple guys. The easiest, the fastest, the cheapest way, cheapest way to clean your cell bar. I'm still in disbelief right now guys. I should have Google. I should have asked Google. Google knows everything nowadays. But it's okay. I have a mother in I have a mother in law. That could help me out. I don't need Google, right? So, so yep, guys, it's clean now. Look at it. Oh, guys, it's super clean now. Look how clean it is already. And where's the? Here's the necklace. Look. Oh, look how dirty the. This one is. Done cleaning all my necklaces. So that's done. That's done. Boom, done. Done. Toothpaste. Oh, you know what? I gotta clean this one too, guys. I forgot to clean this one. Hold on. Got one more necklace to clean. Because you know why? I cleaned this one the wrong way. I use baking soda on this one for experiment. My other Tiffany necklace. And the dummy, such a dummy, didn't do my research before doing it. I clean a soda. And my mother in law said, You should not do it, baking soda, because you know why? It's corrosive. But then good thing that I have. But if you clean your sterling silver with baking soda, guys, make sure that you rinse it. Pretty good. Pretty good. Pretty good. So I'm just cleaning this one. I'm polishing this one, basically, because I this is the one that I clean with baking soda before I knew about all the toothpaste thingy thing. So yeah, this is the one. I'm just polishing it. All right guys, that's it for today. Thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys on my next video. Now, clean your necklace and try it guys. This is legit, literally. I'm not even joking you guys. This is legit. We'll clean your silver. All right, all done. Here we go, guys. We're done, and that's the result of then. That's the result. We're done cleaning it using this guy right here. So yep, it's all good. It's all clean now. I can wear it again. All right, thank you guys for watching.